Greetings, fellow adventurers. Today, we're diving into the mystical world of Zelda, Tears of the Kingdom. In this episode, we'll uncover the secrets of obtaining the legendary champion weapons from Breath of the Wild. Hold on tight as we guide you through the process of converting ordinary weapons into extraordinary legends. Get ready to wield the power of the Great Eagle Bow, Boulder Breaker, Light Scale Trident, Simtar of the Seven, and Daybreaker. Our first conversion starts with the Great Eagle Bow. To obtain it, we'll need a Swallow Bow. Journey to Flight Pass, east of Rito Village, and find the Swallow Bow near a cooking pot. Take the Swallow Bow to Teba in Rito Village, and he'll transform it into the Mighty Great Eagle Bow using some wood piles and three diamonds. Next up is the Boulder Breaker, which begins with a Cobble Crusher. Head west of Death Mountain to an enemy camp, grab the Cobble Crusher, and then visit Fugo at the blacksmith in Goran City to forge the boulder breaker. Now, let's obtain the light scale trident. Find a Zora spear near Tabal Woods and bring it to Dento in Zora's domain. He'll transform it into the powerful light scale trident using some flint and three diamonds. The Simtar of the Seven awaits us. 
Locate a Gerudo Simtar either in the ancient prison ruins or at the statue of the Eight Heroine. Once you have it, rescue the Gerudo blacksmith from Torma Dunes, and she'll convert it into the Simtar of the Seven. Lastly, let's acquire the Daybreaker Shield. Climb the pillar near the Great Cliffs in Gerudo Desert to find a Gerudo Shield. Once you've rescued the Gerudo Blacksmith, she'll transform it into the Mighty Daybreaker. Congratulations! You now possess the legendary champion weapons in Zelda, Tears of the Kingdom. Join me in the next episode as we continue our adventures and unlock more secrets. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and hit that notification bell to never miss an epic moment.